So many partners made huge contributions to the success of the 148th Open in 2019, and I'm delighted to be able to recognize that in a very positive and tangible way this morning. Before I can confirm the news that you've all been waiting for, and I'm sure will hardly be a surprise to anyone, I would just like to briefly set out our vision for continuing this excellent relationship and developing and enhancing both the Open and Royal Port Rush's position in world golf in the years and decades to come. I've often said that big time sport needs big time venues and big time crowds, as well as an outstanding golf course. That means venues which can offer the space and facilities needed to accommodate substantially more than 200,000 people during the week. It means a transport infrastructure that can enable tens of thousands of people to come and go from the championship at the same time as the wider community go about their daily lives with minimal disruption. It means public agencies and local authorities being able to invest resources, energy and time in being able to work with us to make this all happen over years of preparation. We undoubtedly received that support here in Northern Ireland, and that's why we are so excited about what can be achieved here in the future. We see huge potential for Port Rush to continue to develop and enhance its status, and perhaps achieve the same iconic status for golfers throughout Northern Ireland as St Andrews enjoys in Scotland. There's a lot that needs to fall into place for that vision to be achieved, however, and the continuing support of the Northern Ireland Executive, its agencies and the local authority will be essential. But if we can all do that, then the sky really is the limit. Turning back to more immediate matters, I would now like to make today's formal announcement, and that is I am delighted personally and for the RNA and for Royal Port Rush and for Northern Ireland to confirm that the 153rd Open will be played here at Royal Port Rush from the 13th to the 20th of July, 2025. We look forward immensely to staging the Open here again, and the countdown starts now. Thank you very much. Can I say that I'm thrilled uh, to be able to join the RNA and our other partners here today to welcome the return of the championship in 2025. As others have remarked, the 148th Open in 2019 has already gone down in history as one of the great Opens. A phenomenal venue, record-breaking numbers of joyous spectators, and of course, a fairy tale ending. And as we embark on rebuilding our tourism economy, today's announcement will give a huge boost to businesses across the country and will galvanise our efforts to re-establish Northern Ireland as a global destination, not only for golf, but for holiday and leisure visitors from key markets across the United Kingdom and Ireland, Europe, the United States and further afield. None of us, I think, could have imagined that uh, we would face into such an incredibly difficult time during 2020 and 2021. The pandemic has deeply affected people's lives, our society, and of course, our tourism and our sporting events. So it really is wonderful. I think that we can look forward with great hope and optimism in relation to this good news story, which has been announced here today, that the Open will in fact return to Royal Port Rush in 2025. Following the severe impact, and difficulties created by the COVID pandemic, this is a piece of good news and an event that we can all look forward to. The return of the Open Championship is great news on so many levels for our club, the local community, the Northern Ireland economy and Irish golf. And with the support of a developing, diverse and cohesive uh, events industry, we can create more. I'd be assured uh, that we'll be putting our shoulders to the wheel to deliver another record-breaking event in 2025. Thank you.